America's party presidential candidate Tom Hoffling said he'd shut down all abortion clinics in the United States if he were elected president. Stated Hoffling, all officers of government in this country in every branch at every level have as the first obligation of their sacred oath the protection of all innocent lives within their jurisdiction. Should I be elected to the office of president of the United States, I will keep my oath. Even arch liberal Supreme Court Justice Blackmun in Roe versus Wade admitted that, of course, the child in the womb is protected by the 14th Amendment if they are a person. In response, Hoffling said, since it is self-evident that they are a person, my first act as president after having sworn the oath will be to publish a presidential finding to that effect. My second act will be to ask for the resignation of anyone in the executive branch who will not act accordingly. My third act, he says, will be to order the closing of every abortion facility in the country as per the explicit imperative requirement of the supreme law of the land. Tom Hoffling is resolute in his resolve that no person shall be deprived of life without due process of law, and that no state shall deprive any person of life without due process of law, nor deny to any person within its jurisdiction the equal protection of laws. Our question to Mitt Romney, who supposedly has turned pro-life, Mitt, if elected president, would you act so boldly and heroically to protect unborn U.S. citizens? Or would you take an even more liberal view than Roe versus Wade Justice Blackman? Or will you just hide your head in the sand pretending the issue doesn't exist?